morning guys. So this is our first official day of Vietnam. In Vietnam, in Ho Chi Minh City, we arrived yesterday, but we got tired. Or I'm actually, I don't know if you hear from my voice, but I'm sick. But yeah, I got sick, still got sick. We went out last night, had a great time in Boy Vien. We just drank and partied all at a few clips from my <laughs> Instagram story here. Drunk night, you know. Drunk night with good vibes. <laughs> but anyway, um, getting into uh vietnam was another story like i don't know if you saw my facebook post or whatever but it wasn't good it wasn't good i feel like i got scammed but then again like whatever um my visa cost 135 they charged me for a whole year but i'm here for a week i told them i was only here for a week and they insisted to pay that i paid the 135 so i did but it is what it is now I'm done. We're going to venture out Ho Chi Minh City, go eat some more banh mi's because we, ha we had like six last night. Ooh, doorbell. But the lady we got the banh mi from last night was so sweet. We tipped her a lot. Not a lot. Yeah. Not a lot, but like, well, no. I think it's a lot. <laughs> no. But yeah, so we're gonna go do some laundry here because we have a lot of laundry, or I should say she has a lot of laundry because what? She's a thick girl. <laughs> but yeah, um, we're gonna do that and we'll take you on the journey. We'll go to like markets and all that, and it'll be fun. By the way, the weather here is so much better than in Malaysia and Singapore and like Bali because it's nice, breezy, cool weather, and it's not humid at all. Like, it's amazing. All right, guys. If you're ever wanting to do laundry, F5 Laundry. F5 Laundry. Alright, so F5 Laundry is a great place to do laundry. That's what we have to say. Cheap, affordable. I don't want to say cheap because that's like cheap. <laughs> and hotel laundry is just way too expensive. They charge you like $3 for one item. But anyway, we're about to go to Bintang. Sis Bintang? Bintang. Bintang. What was Bintang? You had that Bintang bag. That was on Bali. Bali. Anyway, yeah, we're going to Bintang Market. Market? Yeah. Market to eat some more. To eat breakfast. Look at my double chin, guys. When I do sideways. This is the best banh mi right now. It's in Bintang. Best banh mi. Let's go. We love banh mi. And pho. Can we get pho too? Yeah. Okay, good. Why not to come to Vietnam and not to pho? Okay. All right. Finally, a Bintang. is what I live for. Oh my god. Food, food, food! Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. We're so excited. More coffee. Anyway guys, we're gonna do some shopping after this. And um, regular Vietnamese coffee. Say hi. <laughs> Just, so cute! Just a regular Vietnamese dish. Alright, so like, funny story. They gave Cecile two chairs because she's a thick girl. But we ordered two fuzz, some spring roll, summer roll, and then water and then all that. All damn, we should have said somewhere else. But we'll show you the food when it gets here. Ooh, thank you! We got our food. She's a happy camper. Oh my god. It's so good. Authentic. Go. Give me your best Mark Weens. That is 
colors. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. 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 <laughs> so nice. All right, guys. So we are at the Saigon Sky Dive. Good morning, Vietnam. Good afternoon, oh, Vietnam. Good afternoon. I was trying to call Metal Jacket, but whatever. Ooh, so nice. Go give me a tour. By the that gift shop? Or, but it's a couple right there. Cool. Yeah. Oh, and the shirt two is after. The... Amazing. Great. Thank, Thank you. So You're welcome. Good morning, Hoi An. Good morning. So we are in Hoi An. This is our first official day. We were here last night, or we got in last night. And don't get me started with the airport again. <laughs> But anyway, we went to the old town last night. I should have brought my camera because it was beautiful. But I'll put some clips here from my iPhone, we'll which will us, which will. Oh yeah, we're going tomorrow anyway. Which will, I'll start doing by now. Use my iPhone at night because I don't know how I'm not camera <laughs> savvy about you know flickering lights and shit. I don't know what shutter speed to put it in. I don't know. I don't know anything. So I'm just gonna yeah, do whatever. Are you ready? Yeah, wait for you. Wait, let's go. All right, so come on, vamanos. Do you want your water? Everybody, let's go. Yes, can you bring it with me? You. You have the key. Oh, uh -huh. guys, this heat is insane. Insane. It's fucking insane. I got it's myself a fan because it's just you. hot as fuck. Cecile's fan died on us, so she's charging it. Oh, we got ice cream. This is really interesting. Why? What is it? No, you must want to sign. So hot, guys. But anyway, we're doing some bargaining right now. Um, I'm not going to record it because it's really hard to record and bargain at the same time, especially when they're looking at you. But we got some good deals. Not as cheap as we thought it was going to be. <laughs> that is the Japanese bridge that they have here in Little Hoi An. Were they um, taken by the Japanese at one point? We don't know history. Well, she loves history. Go. I don't know anything about it. Actually. Yeah, we don't know anything about it. But that's what they call the Japanese bridge. Yeah, it was the, by the Japanese community to link with the Vietnamese. Yeah, it was a way to link with the Vietnamese. Hence the bridge, you know, linking bridges. Oh, right. Unquote. You're the bridge. Yeah. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Oh no, to link with the Chinese quarters. I'm so sorry. I'm oh, sorry. to link with the Chinese quarters. So, I know we've said this a few times already, probably not even once, but wear sunscreen. We forgot to wear sunscreen today, and it's burning, like we're burning up really bad. I'll be dark as fuck, because I'm wearing a sleeveless so I can tan myself out. <laughs> Blackness. Guys, so we are now at a tea house. Reaching out. Come on. Reaching out, anyway, it's not gonna happen. But reaching out is uh, 
Uh, it's an organization. It's a group of physically impaired Vietnamese people motivated to create meaningful independent lives for themselves. Began reaching out as simple craft selling high quality handmade homeware and jewelry. Yeah, anyways, I'm just gonna put it right here. You can pause the video if you'd like to read it, if it ever decides to focus. Ooh, this line though. All right, guys, we are now at the uh, Recommended best bami place in Hoi An by the great Anthony Bourdain. Yeah, rest the man in who peace. Changes. So man who like told us to explore the world and eat their food. Bami Bong. Alright guys, so the verdict, it's actually really good. Mm -hmm. uh, best banh mi ever, right? Yes. Best banh mi ever. Very fresh ingredient. <laughs> We have to jump in, girl. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, we have to jump in. Hi. Oh my goodness, that can eat it, girl, because it's in the edge. Okay, bye. Those tickets are legit. Alright guys. So we are in the cable car. We're literally sweating our ass off. Until he opened the door. You are traveling. Until I fucking opened the windows because I didn't even know these were for real, for real. Like I thought we were gonna fall or whatever. Over well, here, she's here, her ass is eating her pants, and that's just the tea. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're fine. I'm kidding. You're fine. I'm kidding. Wow! Look at that. Look at that world. This is Banna Hill. This is literally the closest I'll get to God. Because I'm going to hell. <laughs> These are gonna open up next year. Oh, they love Celine Dion. Celine Dion here. Yeah. My love. Is it Celine Hand. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Okay. We were just taking photos here and then we see these two guys running across this way. And like we see a drone. We see a drone. We hear it before.
where we see it. Yeah, we hear it. We hear it. And then the drone's like, where? Like right here. Like here's my finger. Pretend it's super close to us, but it's just literally right here. And it slams into this motherfucker. Oh my god, I'm gonna Kind of thing, you know, when you press head home and it comes directly to where your GPS is supposed to be. So it I guess it thought it just its GPS was here because all it was going was doing going straight. It was literally just going straight into the bar and the guy was just running towards us. Honey, you should have done a manual land, sis. Come on. But anyway. It's not our drone. It's not our drone. My drone's safe at home because what? I am careless. Come on, sis, run. Run towards me. Keep going. 